Now, with 800,000 people expected to attend tomorrow's inauguration, massive preparations are underway to keep people safe, keep them in and out of, or get them in and out of D.C. WJZ is live at Penn Station, and George Solis has the security and travel logistics. George? Yeah, good evening, Denise. Many Marylanders will travel to Penn Station in the morning to get to D.C. by train to avoid those expected traffic backups in the nation's capital. Donald Trump is about to take up residence at 1600 Pennsylvania Avenue. We're ready to go at 12.01 tomorrow. The event that will officially send him there, a massive security challenge. We're concerned about every possibility that's out there. When I say concerned, I mean we plan for every possible threat that's out there. Thousands of law enforcement officers from a range of agencies are working around the clock, including hundreds of Maryland National Guard troops. The Coast Guard is patrolling the Potomac River. While customs helicopters buzz the skyline. Play the role of being the ice in the sky. We have a camera about to have the helicopter. There are road closures and restricted areas throughout the district for the inauguration and the parade. Many of them will remain in place through the end of the week. And Denise, there will be more than 28,000 deployed officials to provide security for the event. Back to you on TV Hill. All right, thank you, George.